No, the health department says you shouldn't be worried. The World Health Organization says that most people, around 8 out of 10, have very mild cases and recover without any special treatment. But older people and people with underlying health conditions, like people with HIV who are not currently on treatment, are more likely to see serious cases. So, if cases begin spreading in communities and you are part of one of these groups, the World Health Organization recommends that you avoid traveling, keep your distance from sick people, and wash your hands regularly. If you're HIV positive, make sure you're on antiretrovirals. The National Institute of Communicable Diseases, or the NICD, explains that the virus spreads through droplets in your spit. These droplets carry the virus through the air when someone coughs or sneezes. If you don't cover your mouth and nose when you cough, then the virus can spread as those droplets land on things that people then touch. If you touch something that has the virus on it and then touch your face, you can get infected. That's why it's important to wash your hands regularly. The symptoms are very similar to flu. You should look out for fever, dry cough, sore throat, or difficulty breathing. If you are experiencing these symptoms, you should call the NICD's public hotline on 0800 029 999. If you are feeling sick and have traveled to a country with a lot of cases or been in contact with someone who's infected, the NICD recommends that you contact both the hotline and your doctor. If you think you may have been exposed to this coronavirus but aren't yet feeling sick, then the NICD suggests that you isolate yourself at home for 14 days. If you start feeling sick during this time, you should call the hotline. The best way to protect yourself from not just this virus, but from any infection, is to wash your hands regularly using both soap and water for at least 20 seconds. If you don't have access to water or soap, then you can use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer. When you cough, cover your mouth and nose with an elbow or a tissue. <coughs> Throw all tissues away immediately. Avoid touching your eyes, nose and mouth as much as possible. Try to keep at least one to two meters of space between you and someone who is sick. You don't need to wear a surgical mask unless you are sick or taking care of someone who is sick. These masks only help to stop people from spreading the virus if they are already sick. While South Africa is not restricting any travel, the NICD recommends that people avoid all non-essential travel to countries that have an ongoing spread of this coronavirus. These countries include China, Iran, Italy, Japan, South Korea, Singapore, Vietnam, and Taiwan. The WHO says you shouldn't travel if you're feeling sick. If you do continue with your travel plans, the NICD advises that you avoid contact with wild or farm animals and avoid contact with sick people. No, there is no need for people to be stockpiling items like groceries or toilet paper. Plus, stockpiling things makes them harder to find for people who need them. Currently, there are no recommendations for anyone in South Africa to be keeping supplies of anything.